I have known you folks since OpenStack. There used to be Pro Play, OpenStack, then Kubernetes. So as I always joke, you folks are with the customers wherever they are in the journey. And now we are talking about AI inferencing. So talk a bit about you know this partnership. What is Mirantis doing in this AI space? Well, everything we've done to date was a warm up for the world of AI, <laughs> because ultimately, I think I mentioned that last time we spoke, right? AI is all about inferencing, right? It's about AI apps. And when finally AI apps hit, the one massive biggest workload that humanity would have ever seen is going to be an inferencing workload, which is basically various types of models, big and small, running on the cloud infrastructure. And the cloud infrastructure has to be extremely hybrid and distributed because the nature of the AI workload, it has to run where the data is and it can be stored or generated and it has to, the compute has to come to that data. And it can no longer be run just on the public cloud or just on-prem, it has to be everywhere. And so um, the partnership we have, well, so of course we're the plumbing people, right? We build the orchestration, Kubernetes based and bare metal and all that stuff that's necessary and people running applications don't need to know that, it just needs to work. So we have 15 years of experience making sure it just works. But what needs to happen now is we have to be able to deliver it, uh, the workload everywhere. And that's where uh, G-Core's delivery network becomes you know, a key. And then of course, we need to be able to orchestrate the models and um, deliver that. So our partnership, it started because before Seva went to G-Core, he was working for me at Mirantis, right? And the reason G-Core is such an awesome company is because they have the best talent for um, infrastructure. Some of that came from Mirantis, right? That's the pedigree and the relationships. And so we started, you know, kind of building our personal relationship and it went massively beyond that. Um, so, we did something very unconventional because in the, in the, in the new world of, um, of um, um, I guess, when, you, um, when the new, new technology and ecosystem breaks out, it usually starts with service providers because service providers become early adopters. They prove this, they deliver to their customers and then enterprises come, right? So G-Core as a very, very technology strong service provider, they were the absolute trailblazers in delivering AI automation and also bringing inference to their customers. And we did something very unconventional. We lifted that technology that they created on their infrastructure, made it into software, put it on top of Cordant, which is our um, orchestration everywhere um, piece. And then we're delivering it to our customers. And there has been, um, a big press release with the sovereign cloud in um, in um, in Holland, a company called Nebel, actually uh, taking this technology and making it available to their customers in Holland for now, and also they're now going to Germany. And it's something we were able to light up in a matter of weeks, right? Which is quite amazing. And um, so so that's the nature of this partnership, and it's just the first step. Yeah, I would like to add so. Basically, we are public provider and all our services consumed as a service for our end customers. But from the other hand, the, all our capabilities and the software stack which we deliver to the end customers so they can consume based on the, our infrastructure. From the other hand, as Alex mentioned, enterprises will consume the inference with their data on a private way. And we see that so for the long, long, long distance and journey, so more and more enterprises would like to have all of the services in the same way as they can consume from the public services like hyperscalers and the rest on their infrastructure. And this is the key motion for us. It's the first step also. And the new things which we're trying to discover on the software stack which we can deliver to the enterprises, but we need to find a proven partner for that, who has a long experience, huge experience to working with the enterprises. That's why we choose the Mirantis as the proven partner to combine all our capabilities, how to deliver in the cloud's way, service solution, serverless solution to the end customers, 
package that in the software stack with the air gap functionality and on-prem with the full support, which can be delivered to the end enterprise. Also, the key point that so open source is the one of the crucial part for any kind of the enterprises to also consume any kind of the services internally. So that's why we have all of those strong collaboration and for sure that so the very high-end quality engineering team is also one of the crucial part for day zero, day one, and day two to support and operate the end customers. So that's why we have those natural uh, partnership with the Marantis to deliver distributed. I would like to say that. So this is the one of the innovative solutions. We believe that because most of the inference part came on the centralized way where it can consume your whole GPU cluster, where you can train your models and you serve your models on the same cluster. But also NVIDIA mentioned that, and we will see that. So we will collaborate with the, any kind of the chatbots or generate the images or potentially generate the videos, like how we're watching the YouTube or watching the TikTok immediately. And everybody will think that, so, okay, so it's nature that, so I can discuss with the chatbot or virtual AI assistant online and potentially OpenAI provides the same way. Yeah, so you can ask any kind of the questions and you have immediate answer latency and how you can distribute and load balance your any kind of the request to the any GPUs worldwide and also the sovereign question and how data processing is also the key points. That's why we providing this distributed inference platform based on the distributed Kubernetes from Mirantis, which we can deliver to the enterprises on the private mode or on-prem mode and also in the hybrid mode, which can be interconnected to our public clouds.